Hi friends, welcome to my channel. Today we'll be covering Triple Invisible Decrease, a useful stitch when decreasing, usually seen when decreasing square corners in amigurumi. In crochet, when you look at your stitches from the top, you can see V shapes forming. The front stitch closest to you is the front loop stitch. The back stitch furthest away from you is the back loop stitch. So for this demonstration, I have here two sets of stitches marked with blue and red stitch markers. As you can see, I have marked all the front loop only, so you can see these are the stitches we'll be working on to do the triple invisible decrease. So to do triple invisible decrease, we are going to insert our hook to the front loop only of the next three stitches. So let's insert the hook to the first front loop of the next stitch. Now insert it to the second front loop of the next stitch. And finally to the third front loop of the next stitch. We will currently have four stitches on the hook. Yarn over. Pull the first three stitches. Yarn over again and pull the remaining stitches. Let's do it again. So insert the hook to the first front loop of the next stitch. Insert it again to the second front loop. And finally to the third front loop. Yarn over. Pull the first three stitches. Yarn over again and pull the remaining stitches. I'm going to demonstrate this one more time without the stitch markers. So insert the hook to the first front loop of the next stitch. Insert it again to the second front loop. And finally to the third front loop. Yarn over, pull the first three stitches, yarn over again and pull the remaining stitches. I hope you find this tip useful. I'm currently designing my next crochet pattern. I'm thinking of a Halloween theme, something cute and scary perhaps. I'm not sure yet, so it'll just have to be a surprise. <laughs> Who likes surprises? If all goes well, I'll have the free pattern up for you all in about two weeks time. Take care, my love. See you in my next video.